Let's go over how to use the rate calendar in Onores. To find the rate calendar, go to Tools, then click Rate Calendar. This will show you a calendar view of all the rates for a specific property. You can select which property you'd like to view by clicking the drop down menu here, then selecting the property. You can click this drop down menu to jump to a specific month, or you can simply scroll up and down to view the rates for any specific month. If we'd like to change the rates, let's say the 18th through the 24th, you can click and drag the range. And if you go up here to selection mode, you can change this to toggle, range, and columns. Columns will allow you to select a group of dates in a column. Range will do exactly what we just showed. And toggle will allow you to select multiple different dates at a time. If we'd like to adjust the rates from the 18th through the 24th, we can select those, then click the Set Rates button. This will bring up a window where you can set the rate and set the minimum amount of nights. If we want to change this to 400, simply put that here. And if we want to change the minimum nights to 3, we'll add that, then click Update. Now we see the calendar reflects the changes we just made. You can also use the Advanced Select tool to select a date range and select which days of the week you'd like to select. If we'd like to select the entire month of January, we can do so like this, then click Select. Now we'll see all the dates are highlighted and we can set the rates or clear the rates using this button right here. We'll see we're asked if we want to clear the spot settings for rates and minimum nights. We'll go ahead and click Clear. And now we see we don't have any rates set. If we'd like to add rates for all these nights, we can simply go back to the Set Rates button. We'll make this 500, and we'll set the minimum nights to 3. Now if we click Update, all the nights will be updated with the $500 per night rate and the 3 night minimum. If we look towards the top, we'll also see we have a Seasonal Rates button. If we click in here, you'll see all the seasons that you create under the Seasons tab. Here we see we have a default that will cover the entire year. Currently we have 100 set on our Bear Valley property, but we don't have anything set on our Poppy's Hideaway property, which is why when we clicked Clear Rates, we did not have any rates. If we change this by clicking in, then clicking Set Rates, and make the nightly rate 200, you can also add a weekend night rate. We'll make this 250. Now if we click Update, the default nightly rate will be set to 200 and 250 on the weekends. If we go back to the calendar, then go back to Poppy's Hideaway, and we use the Advanced Select tool again to select all of January, we can click Clear Rates, and we'll select Rate and Minimum Nights, then click Clear, and we'll see that the default season we had created earlier has now been applied. It's 200 per night during the week and 250 per night during the weekend. If you'd like to change which nights are weekend nights, you can go to the top and click Settings. Here you can change the Friday to Saturday to any of these options. If we click Friday to Sunday, then click Save, and we go back to the calendar, select that same property, and we'll scroll down to January. We see that Friday, Saturday, and Sunday now have the 250 per night rate. If we click the Spot Rates button, we'll see all the spot rates we have set. We currently have 13 pages, and that is because each one of these is a single night rate. If we scroll back up, we'll see we can also set rates and clear rates. If we click the Clear Rates button, you can set a date range and select which property you'd like to clear the rates for. You can also choose to import or export spot rates, and you can import from a channel. If you'd like to find specific spot rates, you can use the filter button. From here, you can set the property and the date range to search for. You also have the option to batch copy rates onto another property. To learn more about batch copy and seasonal rates, check out our other videos. That is how you use the rate calendar in Onores.